What's up, Better Days? Today we're at Center Hill Dam. That is two generators going, number one and number two, the one in the corner and the one in the middle. This water is way up in the trees. And it's gonna be like this until they draw down that lake to winter pool. So what do you do when the water's way up and they're not turning it off? Well, you go fishing anyway. We're gonna go out here and give it a shot. I got some live bait, I got some worms, I got some shiners. I even bought some bluegill at Big Charlie's Bait Shop to use. We're gonna see if we can get something to bite out here. Sometimes it's tough when it's like this, but we're gonna see if we can't make it a better day. If you've never come out here on a kayak because you're unsure of what the conditions are like with the generators on, this is what it's like. It's fine. If you're on this side of the boat ramp, this boat ramp on this side. It's relatively calm. You can fish all this area. You can really have a, a fantastic time. There we go, sunglasses time. Awesome. This water is as brown as it can be. I mean, it is brown frown. I've only seen it browner than this one time this year. Got one. He must have been on there a while. I didn't feel anything. Oh, he's barely skin hooked. Little guy. But he's greedy. And he is a largemouth. Let's look at the, some of the key points of largemouth bass. First of all, this right here is going to be solid and not broken up. A spotted bass, that'll be spotted spots it'll be broken up vertical line and then this distinct big tall and big tall with a little indention in the middle sometimes this indention will be really pronounced and there won't be any connection at all and then of course the tongue patch which is absent on this one he's fat he's a good guy all right i i tried a whole hour at the waterfall i was able to get three or four little bass to hit and I was able to catch one I'll go give it some time over at the generating water maybe see if we can't catch a fish over there all right first I'm gonna try this really big setup with uh I've got a big bluegill on here that I got at Big Charlie's Really, it looks like a green sunfish, but whatever. That's what they're selling. I'm gonna throw him right up there next to that wall. Let's see if we can't pin him next to it. It's pretty close. Okay, let's try bobber over here. Mm, that might not work. I can't see it at all. It just disappeared. It could be underwater. It could be floating. <laughs> I'm not sure. All right. Let's try a worm in the generating water. We're not having much luck and we are fighting this wind. It's typical this time of year, change of the season. You get a lot of really blustery days. Today's one of them. I've got these 
white jigs I got in the mail. I'm gonna try these. I'm having a tough time. And these might be just what I need. No way, first cast. I've got one. Oh, first cast with that white jig. I caught a fish. I have been fishing for hours and I only caught that one bass. Live bait is what I've been using. And look at here, we got us a gizzard shad. I almost want to keep him. He's such a good bait. Let him go. Well, that was cool. First cast. <laughs> I knew that was gonna happen. I wish I'd have said it. Shit, no way. I don't know what they're doing, but they have a potential of opening up the floodgates or the sluice gates or the orifice gate or any number of things. And we just don't want to be anywhere near that. Golly, the wind is right in our face. As strong as it's been all day. Oh my gosh. I was planning on staying here all day. If I had to guess, I'd say they're probably gonna open that third gate or that third generator. But if they open a the sluice gate, it's gonna come all crazy out here. So we gotta be as far away as we can be. Kinda hope they do open the sluice gate just so I can see it. Whoa. Pour all that water out. Oh, there it goes. I really start to see it kicking up now. That number three generator. I'm watching the water around me rise slowly. Cool, well, you know what? Three generators. It was already hard. I, I I couldn't catch any fish when there was two on. I don't suppose I'll be able to catch any fish when there's three on either. Oh my gosh. The wind on those trees over there. <laughs> okay. The generator's kicked on, a third generator. The wind's kicked up. Another notch. Everything's against me today. Oh, and I just had a bite. Of course, I had a hit. It's, it's, it's raining leaves. Oh my goodness. Oh, I just caught one. <laughs> wow, man, it's, it's beautiful. You know, the other generator kicked on and things are a little crazy looking, but I'm gonna stay. I'm gonna stay. No way. Yes. 
Yes, Rogue, look at your lure go, buddy. Um, I've been having the worst day, and live bait is not doing anything. And all of a sudden, I put this on, and bam, two fish. Bam, just like that. Bam. And that's a large mouth. And man, it's a little guy, but we're finally catching fish, which means I'm having fun. Awesome. Cool, and that was the first cast in there. I wonder if I could catch some more. Oh no, I, I got it hung up. Oh, I got it hung up. Oh, well, there we go, got another one. Rogue, my brother. Oh, I'm slaying them now. This is so much fun. I've been filming for three hours. I caught my first fish in the first 20 minutes and then nothing until I finally tied this on. What's he? He's a largemouth. So that's two nice largemouth and a skipjack herring that I caught with this little guy. Woohoo! You guys know there's a, uh, a waterfall in the corner over here. He's getting swallowed up by this generating water. It looks like it goes quite a bit higher. It's like eventually he's going to be completely underwater. Let's see if there's anything swimming around up in there. Got one. <gasps> it come off. I had one. That was fast. I might need to go stand in the corner. Got one. Yes, let's see what it is. Feels good. Best fish of the day for sure. Feels like a bluegill. Oh, it is. Oh, it's a big old bluegill, you guys. Look at this monster bluegill. Uh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm having so much fun. Look at how big this bluegill is. Real easy to get up here today. The water's all the way up on top. Let's go stand in the corner and see if we can fish in that area there. This is working really well. I want to try a trout magnet. I want to get a little smaller and get down in that corner. Let's see what it is that was biting down there. There we go. A little uh, trout magnet with a gulp minnow. Let's give that a shot down in there. got here oh my another monster bluegill my goodness
bluegill. Good one. Oh wow, heck yeah. Cool. Got another one. Oh, that's not, if that's a bluegill, it's a real big one. Ooh, it might be a real, real big bluegill. Oh, wow. Get up here. Wow. <laughs> These are the biggest bluegill I've caught this year. These are huge. Got one. Finally catching fish after fish after fish. It took getting out of the kayak and standing on the bank to make it happen. Got one. Cool. This is so much fun. Just standing here catching fish. Oh, what have we got here? What have we got here, a crappie? Oh, paper mouth, come here, you. Look at that, that's a, that's a keeper crappie. Oh, wow, that is a keeper crappie. Woo wee, woo wee, look at that. All right, cool, man. We, we got into him here. Slap, he slapped the water. Uh-oh, got a good one. Another bluegill. Come here. There we go, there's a good fish. Might be another crappie. Might be a big bluegill. Oh yeah, nice hefty bluegill, golly. Wow. Woohoo, I got another little fish. What have we got here? We've already caught four species. What have we got now? Another little bluegill? Come here, you. Yeah. So if he choked it. Got one. Cool, man. We we're really having some fun. Ooh, that don't feel like a bluegill. It feels different. It is different. Oh, it's another crappie. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. We're, we're really having some fun. This is a lot of fun. <laughs> there we go. Fish. Good one. Big bluegill. My goodness, this is a heck of a bluegill. Oh my, look at the breast on this thing. He's almost a red breast, he's so beautiful. My goodness, look at this thing, wow. Oh, there we go. Nice, another little bass on my. 
Oh, 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 it's a fifth species, you guys. Smallmouth bass. I don't care how small it is. I am super stoked. I wasn't catching any fish, and I pulled this thing out. And now we're catching them, and we've got largemouth, smallmouth, uh, skipjack herring, bluegill, and crappie. And now we're actually catching some fish. This is fun. How you doing, guys? All right. Oh. Man. It got chilly. It was really warm earlier. Yeah, it wasn't too bad. Holy smokes, it was hot. Look at the uh, forest in the trees. The, the trees in the river is crazy. <laughs> It gets like that when they turn three generators on. That's uh, that's as much generation as they can do right there. I usually don't fish when they're generating this much because it's hard. Um, that was a tough day, but I was saved by my cool new lures. Appreciate that. Thanks for my cool lures. Rogue, appreciate it. Thanks you guys for watching. Have a better day.